Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I like what comicbook.com is doing here. I think this makes sense. When you put in your title, rumor, it says that these this is a rumor that's going around. And there have been a lot of rumors going around that are not factual. And even some really credible people have been buying into these rumors. And I don't like that. Now let's start into this rumor that Justice League Extended Cut is going to get home release and it's going to be the cut that is basically a Joss Whedon cut. Now there's a lot of hate to Joss Whedon. For a guy who finished off Justice League, I, there's a lot of hate towards this guy. That's not cool. Um, well, let me get into it real simply. First of all, um, Justice League Extended Cut, whether there is one or not, um, it's not going to ever be a Joss Whedon cut. It's going to be a Zack Snyder cut, no matter how you look at it, okay? But the thing is, m many people are pushing for Zack Snyder to finish off a version of the film. He hasn't finished it off yet. And that to be the home release. I would say you should have options. So if you liked the current version, that should be there in home release. And then if you want to get, just like with uh, Batman v Superman, there's the theatrical release and then there's the ultimate cut. You should have a choice. So that's all I say. But there is no ultimate cut right now. And uh, I don't know what's happening. People are trying to push for the ultimate cut. I understand that. But at the present moment, I'm all about the theatrical release. Now, there's something circulating on Twitter, which is unverified, which is that uh, Sierra and Hines, he's saying that he was not satisfied with what he saw of his, uh, his, uh, his acting or his role as Steppenwolf in the movie and that he wants also a Snyder Cut. Now the problem with that is Sierra Hines never said that with his own words so that is also a rumor that he spoke to a fan. If he's right there in the Comic-Con um, and he's not, he doesn't say it himself out loud, why would you report that he said it to a fan? So obviously that's a rumor as well. And so what I try to explain to people is if you can't get unverified information if you cannot get verified information, sorry, then that's just rumors. And there's just rumors circulated to hurt the theatrical release of the film. Um, they're trying to make a case with Snyder to have a cut, and I have no problem with that. But do not down the, the present film and say, oh, I, I'm discouraged with what this film is and stuff. I, I don't think anybody working on the film would be so stupid to do that, even if Jeremy Irons did do that for BBS. Um, but I like the, the re theatrical release of BBS, and I like the theatrical release of Justice League, and I'm going to see it today. So, if you guys want to go see Justice League today, you should do so. Bring your families, your friends, and go see it. I got some things to do. I got some chores to do, so you won't see me uh, up online. But I just wanted to share that with you guys, uh, some of the news circulating around Justice League. Check out my Easter eggs videos. I put up two Easter eggs videos. So if you have passed all of that and you went to this stuff because you like gossip and nonsense like that, fine. But do go and check out the Easter eggs that talk more about the film Justice League. One has to do with Alfred Pennyworth and the other one had to do with Bruce Wayne and Alfred Pennyworth and some imagery. Uh, that's very interesting. All right, you guys. Have a great one.